Welcome to Grandad's Storytime. Please like and subscribe. I post new content every day. Pepper Pig. Pepper goes apple picking. It's a lovely sunny morning. Mummy and Daddy Pig have a surprise for Pepper and George. Today is a perfect day for apple picking, says Daddy Pig. We'll use the apples to make a pie for Granny Pig and Grandpa Pig, says Mummy Pig. Hooray! Pepper and George cheer. They love apples and they especially love pie. Pepper and her family arrive at the orchard, but the apples are very high up in the trees. How will we reach them? asks Pepper. Ho ho, says Daddy Pig. I have a trick for picking those apples. On the count of three, shake the tree, says Daddy Pig. Pepper and her family hold on to the tree trunk. One, two, three, they shout. Shake, shake, shake. The apples come falling down. Soon, Pepper's and George's baskets are full. Hooray, cheer Pepper and George. Daddy Pig, your trick worked. I am a bit of an expert at apple picking says Daddy Pig. Do we have enough apples now for Granny and Grandpa's special pie? asks Pepper. Almost, says Daddy Pig. We just need a few more from the trees at the very top of the hill. Those apples are the juiciest. Are you sure, Daddy Pig? asks Mummy. I think we have plenty of apples now. But Daddy Pig is sure. He leads them up to the hill. Pepper and her family shake the tree, but the apples don't fall off. Mmm, says Daddy Pig. Maybe if we shake it a bit harder. Shake, shake, shake. The apples still don't fall off. What do we do now? asked Pepper. There's only one way to reach those apples, says Daddy Pig, and that's to climb. Well, do be careful, Daddy Pig, asked Mummy Pig. Daddy Pig climbs to the very top of the tree. He climbs out onto the farthest branch to get the juiciest looking apple. Daddy Pig almost reaches the apples when, whoa, the branch bends and Daddy Pig falls. Sploosh! Oh dear, Daddy Pig has fallen into a big muddy puddle and splashed everyone with mud. Are you okay, Daddy Pig? Asked Pepper. Yes, shouts Daddy Pig, and I reached the juiciest apple. Back at home, Mummy Pig takes all the apples to the kitchen. It's time to make the pie, she says. Oh, goody, says Pepper. Mmm, says George. First, Mummy Pig makes the pie crust. Then they make the apple pie filling. Pepper and George help with the stirring. They use sugar, eggs, cinnamon and the most important ingredients of all. The apples! shout Pepper and George. Soon the apple pie is fresh out of the oven. Mmm, says Daddy Pig. It smells yummy. Can we eat it? Not yet, says Mummy Pig. We have to bring it to Granny and Grandpa's first. Pepper and her family drive to Granny and Grandpa Pig's house. Hello, my little ones, says Granny Pig. What's all this? Surprise, cries Pepper. We've made you an apple pie. It's delicious, says Granny. How did you make it so yummy? Daddy picked the apples from the very top of the tree, says Pepper, and got us all muddy. But it was worth it. Snorts Daddy Pig. Hee <laughs> hee What a fun day of apple picking it has been. The end. Thank you for watching. If you like this content, please give me a big thumbs up. Please subscribe. It's free to support us and allow us to create more great content.